talented big men have the capability of slowing down one very talented big man. He emphasized, slow down. Nobody can stop me. He does know, however, if he's double teamed, he's going to kick the ball out to his teammates. He said, I expect them to make their shot so they cannot employ that strategy all game. Finally, I spoke to Horace Grant about this rivalry. And he said, you know, it's very difficult to hate the Spurs. There is no Bill Lambeer out here. <laughs> Mark? All right, Jim. Yes, even Phil Jackson was telling us earlier, it's, it's hard to take verbal shots at the Spurs. You know that Phil would never do that. <laughs> but he's on edge right now. What kind of execution, what kind of shooting will we get early? And Shaquille O'Neal goes right shot by, by Robinson. That's four of the last five of the regular season. Overall, six of the last seven, including the sweep in the second round of the 1999 playoffs. Three-second violation is called by Joe Crawford. Who and Robinson, on the other end, it's been Shaquille O'Neal. Rick Fox played by Danny Ferry. Horace Grant guarded by Tim Duncan. Here's Fox putting the move on Ferry, getting it to Jack. A crowd enjoyed that one. So right over the top of the defense, that was too easy if you're the Lakers. Spurs with a 6-2 lead. Lakers trying to get Shaq involved early. They'd like to get him off the lane right where he is right now. They feel like if he has to make shots and not lay it to dunk, they will have a better chance to defend him. And you pass intended. For Duncan. Now, you mentioned Shaq grew up here in San Antonio, started Cole High School, but he is seen as a villain here in San Antonio. In fact, in his recently released book entitled Shaq Talks Back, <laughs> he complains about uh, David Robinson's goody two-shoes image and says he'll never forget 13 years ago when Robinson brushed him off when he gave Shaq his autograph. Foul is called. Spurs with an 8-2 lead. We played four minutes. O'Neal able to get possession. Now, when you get it that deep, get out of the way. You see Shaq with a little smile on his face. That's the. If you want to keep your eye on Shaquille O'Neal, look at paint catches. That's the blue area in there. When he gets it in there, I don't care if it's three. The Los Angeles Lakers finishing the season at 56 and 26, finishing up very strong. That's a wild shot, a usual shot. Is getting a rest, and they cut into that lead. The Spurs within three. Eight minutes to go on the half. One second violation to the ball back to San Antonio. So that's the Spurs defense. Fox thinks he got it. The game with Derek Anderson in the lineup, but still Greg Popovich would prefer to have Anderson matched up uh, with Brian. Here's Shaq with a facial. That's why you've got to try to keep him from catching that ball in the lane. That was just a rose with Robinson being able to step out and shoot it. If Shaq doesn't help, you see him get to the basket like Daniel did there to get that layup, although it was a tough shot. O'Neal with a, a deep jump hook, rebounded by Ori. Robert Ori has come on. Not a nice job. Here's Ori. Nowhere to go. That would have been a travel head. That's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> that was uh, Jim Gray. Always carried in my pocket. For those who may not have recognized Jim. Does that get you in places? To provide offense. Fisher missed the first 62 games of the regular season. Shaq with the bucket and a foul. Kobe Bryant with, with 17. David Robinson leading the Spurs with 12. And Tim Duncan has 11. Here's Shaq. Shaq has been... Daniels and Terry Porter. In game one, David Robinson was not the factor, Danny Ainge, that he needs to be tonight. Greg Popovich, the coach, told us that this morning. No, he started out good, though. He started out very aggressive. They went to the bench like his normal time, kind of like the John Stockton time, four minutes to go in the first quarter, and he never really got back into a group. But that wasn't the substitution that hurt him. It was the substitution of Sean Elliott in the game for Antonio Daniels because that's when Kobe went on fire. Our officials tonight, Teddy Bernard, Hugh Evans, Bob Delaney, a great crew, Shaq inside with a hook over Robinson in the rebound the same team, not the confident team that they came out in game one. It's almost like they're comfortable with where they are. 
after that performance on Saturday. They probably didn't have to change all that much. The pick off inside. Ferry deflects it. Baseline side. He only has help in the middle when Duncan puts it on. That's a mistake to let him beat him baseline. The Lakers are now weathering their largest deficit in this year's playoffs. It's a turnover inside. Picked up by Ellis. See, that's where his help is, right there, in the middle. When he goes baseline like he did against Ori the time before, the help can't get there. Shaq inside, missing number one, tries a second time, and goes up and is fouled. Three-minute mark of the second quarter. Duncan, 13 points. He has offered in the second quarter. O'Neal outside his range. Into the second half, David Robinson with four personal fouls and on the bench. Well, they were bad fouls. He's over here talking to the official, and he gets this picked up the third foul to finish. Jack picks up the fourth foul, and Horace Grant looks over at the official, but that wasn't even the official that made the call. He was talking to a completely different official, like they're going to change it. But that is just that is a really bad mistake right there, and and that could cost him. But uh, Malik Rose has. Daniels has. He's not used to playing this many minutes. The guy was hoping for five or ten minutes sometimes this year, and all of a sudden he's going to get all 48 tonight against one of the best players in the league. Elliot Robinson, Duncan, Johnson, the San Antonio Five. That was sweet. Spurs have the lead. And a foul call, I think, on David Robinson. It was through there, but David Robinson, tough foul, did not think he got Shaq that time. Thought he had all ball. Look at the emotion. In the pants tonight. He does have nine rebounds, but only five points. When Greg Popovich, their coach, told us today they needed him to have a huge game. Well, and they still do. You've got about four minutes almost in this game. He's got to still get involved in this game. This game by Los Angeles. And the crowd was on their seats ready to go crazy and Porter knocked down that shot. Well, this is very important right in here to make a good defensive stop. You've got to definitely try to get out quickly because they're standing around so much of the offensive end. If you don't have it, then take it. On this second half. Well, the only option the Spurs have was Duncan is trying to get the ball inside is to get a jump shot because nobody's cutting through. Nobody's But that man right there, David Robinson, has got the score for them. San Antonio played great defense the other night. Held Kobe and Shaq to under 50 points at 47. They just couldn't put the ball in the back. The officials tonight, Danny Crawford, Jack Neese, and Ronnie Dunn. Only two teams in the history of the NBA have lost the first two games of a best of seven at home and then come from behind to win the series. The 94 Houston Rockets, the 19... Picking up Bryant momentarily. Now here's Shaquille with his first... Once again, the Lakers in the half court being very patient. A meal for the crossover and draws the foul. It's unfair for a man that big to be able to step out on the floor and to show this kind of footwork. Now, the previous possession, he gets the ball in the lane. Robinson does a pretty nice job of keeping him away from the basket, so he has to make a little bit of jump hook. Then the next possession, he steps out on the floor. Now, this is an all-defensive player, Tim Duncan, that he's playing against. Robinson coming over. The crossover dribble, the quickness. The Shaq is into this game early. Out looking for his shot. And uh, Robinson, two of three from the field, six points. Recall in game one, he started very fast and then cooled off. In fact, since that first... Sometimes, Mark, when you're hurt, all you can do is shoot. You go in. I remember Scottie Pippen early in his career with a back surgery doing the same thing, and he uh, became a much better shooter. And the game plan there, Shaq. There's Shaquille O'Neal. When he gets it that deep, puts that body on you, it's too late. And then Kobe Bryant... Missed the three, but kept alive by the Lakers. Four and a half remaining in this first quarter. So now you go to all your repertoire. You spin, get it in the lane, get that little bump, and now kiss it off the glass. So now he's rolling. He's he's got continues to have difficulty finding good shots. a young player throw the ball away from the defensive man david robinson gets up on the high side shaq seals him now david makes a great recovery but shaq with a second effort 
29, just under eight and a half remaining in the first half. Marv Albert with Doug Collins and Jim Gray. Game three of this best of seven Western Conference Final. That three-point line, they're only one of five. The Lakers, five of eight. So Lakers plus 12 at that three-point line. Not expected. And Teron Liu has come on to provide a rest for Kobe Bryant. Jack has been off after the hot start. Points. The Laker lead is back down to seven. Here's Shaq with a drop step and foul. You see the frustration of Shaquille O'Neal that time just jumped right into the chest of David Robinson. But you uh, take a look at the drop step move and the foul committed by David Robinson. Doug, the Lakers are closing in on two calendar months without a loss. We're talking Shaw is on it. Shaquille O'Neal, that's back-to-back -back layups. Greg Popovich is not happy about it. Kobe Bryant able to get an extended rest with Teron Liu. Coming out, Kobe is back on the floor, and then away from the ball, Shaq picks up his third. David Robinson trying to beat him to the spot. Here comes Shaquille O'Neal. And both these two guys just sort of start arm wrestling and running none rules that Shaq dislodges in the post. That's a big foul now. Shaq sits down with three. Spurs within seven. What can they do in this left shot? But Spurs not able to come up with that rebound. Shaq able to repost. And got the roll. Here's Shaq going glass. The most dominant inside player in the NBA, Shaquille O'Neal, weaves his way through two defenders and gets a little soft shot up and in, and then goes off the glass with a little right-hand hook shot. Back-to-back -back scores in the pass. There's something wrong with the lift. Kobe checking the shot clock. Here's Shaq. Kept alive by Grant. And they get the new 24. Well, you're down 13. You get a good defensive sequence, and you don't get the offensive rebound. And Shaq scores going to the killer play. On the line for the San Antonio Spurs. A San Antonio team that went 58 and 24. The NBA's best overall record during the regular campaign. In closeout situations, the Lakers this season, as compared to last year, Anderson, shot clock is at five. Shaq with two on the 24. Oh, here, the See, that can't happen. You're in. in the open, hustle points. One of those are second chance points. What happens? A tough shot against the clock. Shaq just wants it a little bit more. He gets it back and he buries it on the dunk. And so as a result, they've been able to smother those three-point shooters, have not got the same opportunities. Oh, man. Lakers, but uh, yes, uh, he looks like he's hurt. Oh, man. Kobe Bryant has run a layup drill against the San Antonio. Convert, but they got a chance for a second shot. in the playoffs. We saw it against Stojakovic in Sacramento. We saw it in the Portland series. Now we see it here. And trying to handle the ball. He's out of rhythm. And Rick Fox, anytime that ball is exposed, he's getting his hand in there. And this is what it leads to. Shaq with that big, powerful bump in the lane. He sort of gets that shoulder on you, knocks you back. Playoff game. And Shaq's on a wraparound, behind-the-back bounce pass in traffic to a cutter. around for the help. Terry Porter was there for a moment. With a baseline face. As though we didn't show up for the entire series. Maybe we will this half, but it's probably too late. Mark. Kobe Bryant with a nice lead pass that was broken up.
the Spurs had in the regular season and look what they've done in this series minus 20 point differential look at the three-point field goal percentage the opponents three point I mean they, they they've been taken out of their entire the Spurs just winding it down the Los Angeles Lakers running the table for the first three rounds of the playoffs 19 straight wins 11 and 0 in the postseason Shaquille O'Neal, 26 points, 10 rebounds. Kobe Bryant, 24 points, 10 assists. Derek Fisher on fire from downtown, 28 points in all. Shaq and his dad.